Ever wondered what a creature living on top of the world, where sunlight is a luxury and summer is still a chilly affair, eats to survive? Well, the Arctic fox, or Vulpes lagopus, has adapted perfectly to life in such harsh terrain. These creatures are found as far south as the northern edges of North America, Europe, and Asia. Their small, sturdy bodies, about one foot tall and two to three feet long, are their first defense against the relentless chill. Arctic foxes are omnivores, feasting on everything the tundra provides. In the summer, they have a smorgasbord of options. Voles and other small mammals, birds, frogs, berries, insects, bird eggs, and even the feces of other animals. For those near coastlines, the menu extends to fish, seal pups, and seabirds. Winter food is a bit tricky to find, but these crafty canines are resourceful. They trail polar bears onto ice floes and scavenge the leftovers from their hunts. The Arctic foxes are known to travel up to 2,500 miles when food in one area runs low. One of their favorite foods is the lemming, a small mammal that lives throughout the Arctic. The importance of lemmings to the Arctic foxes is such that their population fluctuates in response to lemming numbers. These rodents stay warm and active in winter by tunneling under the snow, where they're invisible to predators but not to the Arctic fox. The Arctic foxes have exceptionally keen hearing. They can detect movement beneath the snow, and when they hear a lemming, they literally leap into action, jumping several feet straight up in the air and diving snout first into the snow, often snagging a lemming like a hot snack. When the snow and ice melt in the short Arctic summer, the fox's white fur sheds to make way for a shorter bluish gray or brown coat to blend in with the rocky tundra. During the warmer months, when prey is more abundant, Arctic foxes store surplus food for the leaner winter months in their dens. These dens can be vast, multi-chambered homes, buried 6 to 12 feet underground. The Arctic fox life cycle begins with a courtship involving chasing and play fighting. Mating usually takes place in spring with the young, called kits or pups, born after 6 to 8 weeks. They start life with gray or brown fur regardless of the season. Both parents take part in raising their kids. Arctic foxes are monogamous and usually stay together for life. To summarize, the Arctic fox's diet is as varied as it is opportunistic, ranging from voles to feces, depending on the season. Their survival strategy includes keen hearing, tactical hunting, and the storing of surplus food. They lead monogamous lives, with both parents involved in rearing the young. Life in the Arctic is undoubtedly challenging, but the Arctic foxes have adapted perfectly to thrive in such a harsh environment. So, the next time you wonder what life is like on top of the world, think of the Arctic fox.